Hello, this is a bonus video for the quiet book that must have been either published earlier or after this one. So this is just as a bonus product by, so if you're if you buy it, you can get some bonus pages. This one is for Sophia, uh, here, you just, this is, so this is bonus, so this is a bonus page, got the ribbon, so if you don't want, if you buy more pages, you can just attach them easily. So here we've got a shaker, you can just open it up, it could be either a shaker or what the cat plays with, it depends, and here you can see the letter S, just, so here you can see just the letter S, as for Sophia. Got different letters, different stuff, so like that. In there. There's a nice little part for the cat with really fluffy stuff and a nice bow. Kind of a bow matching for that, but not only really matching, um, just a nice kind of magnetic play thing. Here we've got the letters of her name. Quite hard to pull out, but with um, once they've been pulled out quite a lot, they would have, of course, been easier to pull out. You can spell them, uh, you can twist them around, for example, if you put it here. And as you know, may notice, this matches the colour and also does the letter. So, for example, S, I can see, oh, that's red. I'm going to put it to the red button. Just like that. So the yellow goes for the yellow. Uh, the green goes for the green green and the purple goes for the purple. I said you can also twist them like this for example. If you are about to play it with this side. There, we've got a nice little cat there. Somebody can sleep. Now, this may be a very short video but of course it's a brainer so <laughs> it has to be a short video. Now, on this side we have some kind of puzzle. This is actually inspired by IQ Puzzler Pro which is really cool because I enjoy playing that game a whole lot. But this is kind of an easier version of it. So here, see different patterns, you can undo it. And of course there are other ways of doing this. Just undo all of them. Show you another way of doing it. For example, just put that there. So there are many different ways of it's a bit uneven, of doing it, of course, because this is and doesn't have any really rules that you should follow. It's just try to make the full square. You can see this is just a different pattern. This isn't, isn't very neat, but this is how you can also do it. There are many different ways. For example, you can also build stuff like um, let me just get it here. Could build, for example, try to build stairs. So you go like that. Try to fill in all of the stair parts. Then you could go like that and like that. Then you could try and fill all of this in. For example, like you could just try <laughs> somehow like that. Maybe then you could just do this and try to fill it in. Mm. <laughs> I don't know how to. But you could also like build some stairs. You could build some kind of houses for example. You could try to build a cityscape like this for example. There's some um, a house <laughs> with you can try to make a roof like that. It doesn't have to actually fit in that. You can just try to make it. That could be a roof. Mm, for example this could be some kind of statue or a tree. And that could be just some more leaves, for example, I don't know, <laughs> like leaves and tree. And you could also do a path, a purple pathway, for example. So yeah, this one is, I think these two pages are maybe my favourite pages out of all of them. Because they're kind of different. i never actually seen and playing with them like I had with the previous uh, actual product. So, this is kind of, I guess, it's my favourite ones. Yes, I really enjoyed them, like, a lot. <laughs> they were very different, but also, at the same time, very similar. So, this is the bonus pages, and 
I really like them, yes. I have to admit, I really, really do like them. Uh, so, yes. Um, <laughs> thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. Bye.